Hi, I'm Tala Awada, the Associate Dean in the Agricultural Research Division. Why Nebraska? Nebraska is a resource-based economy where innovation in agriculture and food industries are key for its economic vitality. I am fortunate to be part of highly talented and diverse faculty and work with outstanding students and staff to create new knowledge and new technologies to address challenges related to food and nutrition security, human health, natural resources, climate change, and develop the next generation agile and adaptable workforce. Why is that important? Because through addressing these fundamental challenges, we can create a resilient and vital community in Nebraska and around the world. Hi everyone, Ola Kolmanchuk here, and I'm Nebraska Research. I think Nebraska is an ideal place to work because of all the um, support and collegiality that one can find here. Our basic research is set to unravel important mechanisms taking um, place in the mitochondria and happening to underlie multiple human degenerative diseases and aging. Uh, understanding uh, these uh, conditions and mechanisms is an important first step in preventing and uh, combating these diseases. Um, and Nebraska's keen interest and investment in this research are really unique and wouldn't be possible in many places elsewhere. For that, I'm very grateful. Thank you. And go Big Red. As soon as I arrived at Nebraska, I knew it would be an ideal place for me to work. The faculty and students are brilliant. They're friendly, helpful, curious, creative, genuine, and hardworking. My research here at Nebraska focuses on understanding the evolution and function of animal communication, animal mating systems, sensory systems, and the neural basis of complex behavior. At Nebraska, I've been able to take my research in a number of different directions that I never would have imagined prior to moving here. Many of these directions are driven by Nebraska's rich yet understudied biodiversity. Nebraska is a wonderful place to work, a place where I feel seen, heard, and support it. Hello, I'm Cody Hollist. Thanks to the COVID-19 rapid response grants, a group of people from the Department of Communications and Child, Youth, and Family Studies put together a project to try to support families in making sense of parenting during these difficult times and also support National Guard members who have been activated in state active duty to support COVID-19 relief the resources and opportunities to provide this service to people around the country are really a good example of how Nebraska steps up and tries to support families in the very time and moments that that support and assistance is needed most. Hi, my name is Hunter Floodman, and I received a COVID-19 rapid response grant from the Office of Research and Economic Development. Uh, because of this grant, our team was able to produce and distribute over 200,000 gallons of hand sanitizer to Nebraska communities, including schools, hospitals, uh, colleges, and care facilities. Our team was made up of uh, College of Engineering staff and students, Food Processing Center faculty staff and students, and Nebraska Forest Service staff, along with university operations. And uh, all of the resources from the university and Nebraska Innovation Campus, along with donations from private industry and the community made this possible. For me, research at Nebraska is about addressing grand challenges in landscape systems, everywhere from cornfields to cities to cattle pastures. And the challenges that we face today, they aren't simple. They're cross-cutting they're moving targets, and in many cases, they've scaled up to the point that they're difficult to address in isolation. For that reason, I'm, I'm not doing research in isolation. I'm looking for opportunities to connect, opportunities where I can weave my single strand of expertise into broader efforts that help develop and scale up solutions and to positively contribute in that way. I'm Sue Sheridan, the director of the Nebraska Center for Research on Children, Youth, Families, and Schools. Like the state of Nebraska itself, we are at the center of everything. Our work impacts lives through research that enhances learning and development and touches all aspects of humankind. We have pushed the boundaries of understanding how to ensure that all children succeed to the best of their abilities, how to support families in times of adversity, how to promote resilience and mitigate risk for our most vulnerable citizens, and how to ensure that communities and their members thrive.
We're not afraid to tackle the thorny issues facing society today or to roll up our sleeves, work hard and get things done. And that's Nebraska. My name is Jody koenig Kellis, and I am professor and chair of the Department of Communication Studies. I run a research lab called Narrative Nebraska. So for me, being a researcher at Nebraska means that I get to study the link between the ways in which people communicate through storytelling about difficulty, illness, pain, identity, and families, and the link to well-being, people's health, their mental health, their physical health, and their relational health. To me, being a researcher at Nebraska means getting to pursue my lifelong dream of studying how the quality of our communication is linked to the quality of our lives.